welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new my name is Anitra hey y'all so today is a she and try on haul I bought some things for myself for Mother's Day and um, I asked people on my channel if they'd like to see a try on haul and they asked me to do one so here it is now this is not the type of content that I usually do record on this channel if you're new this is not what I usually do so don't expect it to be professional honey okay I am on a weight loss journey and that's the type of content that usually is on this channel um I record my weight loss uh, everything I record me at the gym I record my food sometimes I do my weigh-ins I am also on a debt-free journey and I record those videos here as well um, so I'm going to show you the things that I did purchase. I'm going to tell you how much I paid for them and I'm going to show you me trying them on right here or right here. Um, so like I said, I'm going to tell you how much the things cost. Um, I did not pay this price for these things because I did use a coupon code that I found and I use Rakuten so Rakuten is pretty much if you aren't using Rakuten why not okay Rakuten pretty much is a cashback system you can put an extension on your computer or you can put an app on your phone so pretty much Rakuten once you pay for like say right now for Shein if you go through their site to go to Shein um, it gives you 5% back so whatever your price is they give you 5% back and every quarter or six months or something they give you that money back to your bank account just like two days ago I got $50 back from my purchases I think from October to February or December to February something like that I got $50 back thank you for my $50 thank you so if you want to use Rakuten and you're not using Rakuten I will link that below I will also link everything that I purchased down below like I said this is this is not the type of content that I usually do I have done a, one other try on haul and it was a Amazon workout legging try on haul and um, I will link that below if you're interested in looking at that but that is pretty much it let's get into this video so I have everything pulled up here on um, the Shein website and um, I'm laughing because when I asked <laughs> a couple of days ago, I did the vi did a video and I was saying, um, asking if you guys wanted to see a try on haul. And I was saying that I went on here for blouses because I don't have blouses. And I'm looking at everything that I purchased and there's not, I, I remember I told y'all that I don't think I bought a blouse. And there's not one blouse in here. I just bought some random stuff. So let's get to it. First thing up is... Uh, this is a, I think this is it. This is a drawstring, not ruched, huff, what is it called? A drawstring, not ruched, ruffle hem, ditzy floral dress. It is $21 and I got this in a 1X. Now, what is the difference? Some of these things are extra large and some of these things are 1X. I don't know the difference between what a 1X and an extra large is. Also, I never really know what size to get off of Shein because based off of the sizing that they give, when I get things, sometimes they're too big. So I am end up, end up returning them. So I got this in a 1X. It looks like it will fit. But pretty much... It is a green dress. Green is my favorite color. And it's like a little girly dress. It has this, what is this? Ruched, I guess. No, this is the part that's ruched. So, it pretty much goes up on the side as the model. Let me look at this dress, child. I hope it fits good. But pretty much the side is a ruched dress. I probably cannot wear this to work. But it is just a little floral dress. Um, the back. I can't. I'm not giving you a good, good depiction of it. Here's the bottom of it. It has little ruffles at the bottom. And right here on the side. Where a split might have been. It is. These little things. That's the ruched part. Okay. So give you a little leg honey. Little leg. When I'm going to ruch it all the way up too. So let me see. Hopefully that fits good. You guys are seeing it right here. So hopefully it's cute and I don't have to return it. Okay, so this dress is definitely going back because I can't fit it. Now with material like this, this is why I went up in a size because it has no stretch. As you can tell, it's very, it, it don't even go down on my, it won't go down any further. It won't go down any further. My arms are big, so it's tight here. 
and what size did I get this dress in? I guess it, I could have went up another size. Um, I'm not even going to try to zip it. Like, it could be cute, but I'm not going up to a 2X. I'm just not going to do it. I'd rather just not get the clothes. That's just me. I'm not going to get it. Um, <sighs> this makes me sad because I like it. It could be really cute. But it's too tight, honey. It won't even go down. Stomach look terrible. It's tight here. It's tight here. Saddening. Saddening. Um, we shall see, won't we? The next thing. Oh, I got two things like this. This is in a 1X as well. This is in. And I got a 1X in this because it has no stretch. That makes sense. Because my thighs and booty are, are, are kind of big. This is. Uh, called a ditzy floral ruffled split skirt and this was $15 same kind of um, pattern it's little flowers all over it at the bottom it's a little ruffle this one actually has a split you can see hold on let me just hold it up for you it's a split there it zips on the side that zips in the back this looks cute I want it to feel like, mm, mm, mm. This is something I could do. I just put on a random top with it. But this is really, now this is me. This is my style right here. I like it. I like this giving a little leg. Yeah, that's cute. Really cute. I think that's going to be cute with a little um, white tank. Okay, so that's that. Hopefully that fits good. Number two, what is this? This one, I don't know. Let's see what it is. What size is this in? I probably should have got this in an extra large. This is called the Plus Solid Shoulder Pad Dress. And this is $14. And it literally has shoulder pads. And it is just a dress. A pullover dress. And I think this is not going to fit the way I want it to. It already looks big up here. And it looks... Oh, I like my stuff to fit like tight. I'm going to just be honest. I like tight clothes. I don't want it to be big. Or or even loose so I mean if it fits good then great but it looks like it's gonna be a little big if it's big I might be able to keep it for work but it's just a plain dress it is in what color is this blush like a blush color pink and it's just a shoulder pad dress and very very plain yeah I'm not feeling it at all it's given very much um, swap me vibes, like swap me plus size section vibes. Um, I don't like stuff like this. I don't like stuff like this. It's cute on the model, though. It looks cute, but it's just not. <sighs> stuff like this is either I'm going to wear it to work. Or I'm not going to wear it at all. And I wouldn't wear a skirt this tight with this booty to work. Um, so... There are people that would, though, child. I mean, do you? Do you, boo? I mean, you're trying to catch at work, but I'm not. Ain't nothing there. Um, uh, maybe if it was in a different color, but it's still giving me very much swap meat um, Asian clothing vibe, and I'm, I'm not. I don't. I know that it was cheap, but I don't want it to look cheap, and it's very much cheap. Um, I don't like it. So this is definitely going back. It's definitely going back. I mean, it's cute, but it's not giving what I needed to give. I don't know. This is my my waist beads, y'all. I don't know. Let me look at myself in the mirror. Hold three, on. okay? Next thing I got. Let me get through all the clothes first. I got a black dress. Let me make sure this is the one I'm seeing. Oh, this is the first thing that I put in my bag. <laughs> now, this is called a crocodile embossed mermaid dress. And I got it in an extra large. And this was $14. And if you can see, it is crocodile. It is very stretch. 
Oh, this might be really cute on. It is literally like a crocodile uh, mermaid dress. It goes all the way down into mermaid. Oh, that's going to be cute. It is a little sheer. A little sheer. But this is an extra large. Um, but hopefully it's cute on, girl. Oh, this is giving me all that I need and more. Ooh, wee. Ooh, wee. I can't wait to wear this. Oh, this is cute. Let me get something for this stomach, though. This is real cute. Oh, she in. Yeah, I can't wear this to work, honey. This is definitely not for the workplace. Oh, yes, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh, yes, I love this dress. Oh, you know what it reminds me of? School days when Tisha Campbell and other mother chicks is singing that song that I don't want to be alone tonight that reminds me of that right there honey and they was giving it to you in that dress this right here oh I think this is gonna be too big I can just feel it, the, the material this is gonna this is called a plus scoop necks backless fitted dress and this was $16 and this is in a 1x yeah I'm not gonna be. Able, I'm not gonna be feeling this. Ugh, it's really cute on too, on that model. Okay. Yeah. Damn. See, this is why I don't like buying from plus parts. I just want to buy an extra large from regular parts so it can be fitted and look good. When you get to the plus, they be. I don't know what plus. Like, do they think people got big old gigantic waist and boobs? Like, everybody didn't got that. Look at this. This is supposed to be a fitted dress. It says fitted. This is a 1X. Man, I'm going to have to return this and get a smaller size. I can already tell this is not going to fit the way I want. But pretty much it's a dress. And then this is a back. That makes me sad. It doesn't have any splits or anything. It is just a straight dress. Okay. Um. Mm -mm. It's giving me very much house dress vibes. Um... I get the concept, but it's a no. I'm definitely going to see if I can size down one. And maybe I'll like it then. But I like the back. Let me show you guys the back. Raw and stuff, though. But there's the back. It's cute. But mm -mm, it's not giving what I need at all. <laughs> now I don't even know if I want to keep the dress like at all like get a different size at all it's cute but it's giving very much house dress vibes it does go down and a little tighter at the bottom but I think I'll probably like it if I got it in a smaller size I get the concept of this loosey goosey stuff but I'm not a loosey goosey girl I like it to be a little bit tighter maybe if it was like um, I don't know I just don't like it I'm gonna see, maybe I can size down and try again, but it's giving house dress vibes, and I don't like house dress. I'm already knowing that's not gonna look the way I want it to. I'm really sad about that. Really, because that's really cute. I mean, although I, it can come, this is a 1X. Next thing, I'm just moving on. 1X for this, how do I open it? This next thing is like a lounge set. This is called a, a crop tee ruffle hem with shorts. Okay. The shorts, and they have ruffle, ruffles at the bottom. And this was $17. And here's the top. I am still working from home, so this can be something that I wear in the house. And this is like a crop top. Yeah, this is cool for being in the house. Um, yeah. I would never wear this outside of the house. And I don't think this is set up as loungewear. I think people are buying this to wear places um i can't see myself wearing this so anywhere but for the house it's really cute something's missing wow okay i'm looking at this order and everything's not in this order oh child okay shein why y'all gonna say it's all shipped and it's not in here lies you tell okay so anyway i'll deal with that in a minute this right here is uh, all over print high stretch sports 
bra with legging. Oh, I didn't know it was like a bra. I got this in an extra large. This is $15. These are extra large pants and all. I'm already knowing I ain't gonna like it. Why is it so big at the bottom? I'm not keeping this. This is an extra large. The print's really cute. That's why I picked it up. And here's the top. I don't like that, that bottom. This is the top. I would never wear this by itself in the gym. This is not even a really sport. This is not a sports bra. This is just a top. Very cheaply made. Okay, so I'll try that on for you guys, but I don't think I'll be keeping that. And then, yeah, I didn't get everything. Next thing is a bikini top. I got a bikini. Now, this was sold in two pieces. In the bottoms, I got it in a 1X. And in the top, I got it in an extra large. The top, is, um, the top was $11 and the bottoms were $8. Okay, it is this print. Very cute print. It's like a off the shoulder situation. I bought bathing suits from Shein before and based on their sizing I should order a 2x that bathing suit came in and it was huge now I'm looking at this 1x and I think that I should have gotten this in an extra large as well because these bottoms look kind of big they may fit they may fit because my booty is, is not even kind of big. It, it's big um so here's the bottoms and the top I think this is gonna be cute on okay next thing up Oh, no, I did get everything. I was about to say, she and y'all, but they're lying. I was just waiting to say something. Next thing is a, another bathing suit. Mind you, I came on here for blouses. I ain't got no blouses. Next bathing suit up is, what is it at? It's called a leopard cutout one piece swimsuit. And this was $17, and I got it in a 1X, and I'm thinking I should have gotten it in an extra large, but I don't think maybe the extra large wasn't an option because or maybe i was thinking about my bottoms okay so pretty much it's a bathing suit oh, yeah this looks very big so this is the front of the bathing suit and this is the back the booties are covered and this is the tie up so pretty much you put it on and you tie it up underneath and now that i'm thinking about it i could have got a cheaper one off of amazon I have a similar bathing suit to this. No, I don't. It's not like this. But I'm going to try it on and see what it's looking like. It might be cute. I don't really know how the strings go, though. That's the part I'm not trying. I'm not really understanding. The bra part is bigger than what I would want it to be. The bottoms fit fine. The boobs don't. I was trying to tighten it up, but you can't really tighten it up, so... It's cute though. Um, although I don't know how these strings go. So I'm not sure. Tell me what you guys think about this one. This one is a maybe going back. But let me know what you guys think. The boobs have, um, what's these things called? Pads in them. But it's, you know, you can tell that it's I'm not filling it out at all. But I try to make it go. But it's just not... Hmm. What do you guys think? Tell me what you think below. The last bathing suit that I did get is called a three pack plus triangle bikini swimsuit and beach skirt. And it was $16 and I got it in a 1X. And pretty much it's, a, like I said, a three piece. Here's one of the top or the top is a triangle top. The bottom. I think this is going to be cute on this is why I bought this because it has this skirt child it has a skirt and it, it, it has the skirt and you can put it right like this and have that thigh out <laughs> give me what I need this type of bathing suit is totally out of my comfort zone I don't usually buy the bathing suits with tea bra things it's so uncomfortable like I don't even know what how to how to put it on I put it on the best of my ability. <laughs> How do people wear these and don't be uncomfortable like this? Somebody can just literally come back and just be like, mm. 
So here it is with the skirt. Very cute. Very, very, very cute. Mm -hmm. But my roll's hanging over, but that's cute. And then here it is without it. This is it. Oh, my stomach and my thigh is out. Um, yeah, that's cute though. Although my stomach is my biggest insecurity, I will be at the beach literally like this. Say what? Say huh? Who? Who said what? Let me take my waist beads out. So, yeah, I think it's cute. I'm keeping this one for sure, for sure. I think this one's real cute. Black girl magic. Oh, that's that. Last thing that, no, not the last thing that I got. One of the last things that I got. I got a belt bag. This is a minima, minimalist belt bag. It was $5. And it is just what it says. It's a belt bag. So here's the bag. The bag is just a simple belt bag. Nothing, nothing more, nothing less. Here is the belt. I think this came like in a one size fits all. I don't even know how it goes. I'm gonna have to figure that out. But this is the belt. Oh, and you this right here you can carry. Got it. You can also carry carry the purse. So here's the, the thing for the purse, and here's the belt. How does this go through? Oh, it goes like this. And you just slide it through. I can get it through. Hopefully this fit my waist, child. It's going to be a high-waisted belt bag. <laughs> or I could make another hole always. $5, you can't. Yeah, that, I don't know about that. Um, I did look at the measurement of this. Um, I don't know how I am. Pretty much here it is. It's a belt bag. I don't know. But... If I wore it with, well, let me try it on. You guys are seeing me try it on right now, if I can feel it. Last thing that I got was a pair of shoes. These are called um, Quilted Slide Sandals. These are $16, and I got them in a size nine. I wear a size nine. They feel very, very flimsy, but they are very cute. Let me look at them. They're very cute. So here they are. They have quilted detail. Here's the bottoms. I don't know if my little fat feet are gonna fit into this. I always have issues with these kind of shoes. So I always stretch my shoes that are like this because I have wide, chunky feet. But I most likely will be keeping these if they fit. Well, I'm sure they'll fit, but they're very cute. Um, they're very flimsy, though, so I don't know if they're going to go past this summer. You know, listen, look. I don't know if they're going to last past the summer, and that's okay because they were only $16. See, that's why I shop at these kind of things. These kind of things are not going to last past a year, and I'm okay with that. Oh, that is the end of the video, you guys. Okay, I'm hot and sweaty. Trail hauls are not easy. Um, I broke a nail. It popped literally right on off. Anyway, um, if you like the video, go ahead and like and comment below. If you're new here and you aren't subscribed yet, go ahead and subscribe, like, and comment below. Say hey. I do say hey back. Um, let me know which one was your favorite, you guys. Side note, I did have on underwear with all of the bathing suits just in case. I do need to return um, one, and it looks like that I may be returning one. So let me know what you guys think of the bathing suit that I was questionable questioning um and let me know what your favorite is down below again my name is anitra go ahead and tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend and i will talk to you guys later Running on Bye, guys. Hips, wheel, but searching for something i can't feel i just want